In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this jungle slide in PowerPoint. As you can see here, I have added the word the jungle and in the background, I have added the image of the jungle. So here, when I click, you can see here the image in the background started moving and this will not stop until and unless you end the slide or you go to the next slide and this is completely editable you can just change the text according to your own requirement and i have added few more slides for example the next slide you can see here the both the background and the foreground i have put the jungle but when i click you can see here only the image within the text it is moving but the background remains static and i have added one more slide where again both the images of the jungle but the only the background moves but the foreground remains static so depending on the requirement, you can just choose the slide from. Please share, like and subscribe my channel and the only channel on YouTube for PowerPoint where you can get 1000 plus free templates absolutely free. And I have provided the link on the video description section of each video. And you can support my channel through PayPal or Patreon. So let's start the tutorial. Add a new slide and I'm going to add a text called jungle for that go to insert text box and I'm going to type only J and the font I'm going to choose which is the Arial black increase the size how much big you need so maybe I'm going to go with uh, 287 all right then I'm going to add one more the, the next alphabet I'm going to press Ctrl D and I'll say this this is U uh, small letters and this one you can just arrange the way you want okay if you want something like this you can arrange if you want like this it's up to you so this one Ctrl D and I'm going to put it here something like this you can see here any way you want the way you want you can just put Sorry, I'll control D. Then I'm going to say G. Maybe G. I'm going to put it like this. Then control D again. This will be L. And then the last is E. And let me just put it like this. So you can see here I've arranged the jungle word something like this and press ctrl a to select all and you can just put it in the center and for the safer side i'm just going to duplicate this slide in case something goes wrong we have a backup slide okay so now what i'm going to do next is i'm going to select all this text ctrl a and go to the shape format merge shapes i'm going to make it as a union so it becomes as a one you can see here one object only the next thing which i'm going to do is i'm going to add one background image and before that one let me just add one a dark color background so go to insert shapes select the rectangle draw the rectangle covering the whole slide shape outline make it no outline shape fill you can give any uh, dark colors and send this to back all right now this the one the next step which i'm going to do is i'm going to cut this part from the background so let me just show you so i'm going to select this rectangle hold the shift key select this shape go to the shape format merge shape and i'm going to subtract it the moment i subtract it let me just show you what happened you can see here the background within this jungle becomes visible okay the next thing which i'm going to do is now i'm going to add one jungle image so first of all right mouse click go to the format shape i'm going to make it somewhat transparent and then i'm going to insert one more rectangle draw one more rectangle shape outline make it no outline and go to the picture or texture fill see you can see here i've added this picture or you can just go to insert stock images and any image of your choice you can insert it for example i will say jungle and you can see here i've got wide variety of uh, different images you can just choose any image from this okay so anyway i've chosen the image which it's already there the next thing which i'm going to do is i'm going to increase the size of this 
hold the shift key and increase it it should go more beyond than the uh, you can see here let me just show you our slide area is only this one can you see this one only okay now the slide is much bigger this image is much bigger than the slide why we are doing that one to do the animation so let me just send this to back all right and i'll make sure that there's no transparency here and again i'll make sure that there's no transparency here as well then I'm going to select this one. If I, for example, if I just show you, it looks like this, okay? So I would like to do some kind of animation. So select this image, go to the animations, enable the animation painter, sorry, uh, animation pane, and then add animation, more motion paths. Here, I'm going to choose the animation, the right, click OK. Animation will go towards the right. Okay, so again, depending how much you need, far you can just make it like this all right and then double click this one smooth start smooth and i will remove timings i can make it very slow click ok and if i play when i click you can see here it works something like this now if you don't want this to stop you can auto reverse this animation or you can do until end of the next slide also either way okay and click ok so now if i play you can see here it comes like this again it comes back all right so it keeps on repeating 